Poison Murphy became only the third flat jockey to fail a pre-racing breathalyzer test for a second time when stood down at Newmarket on Friday and prevented from taking his six mounts. The rider, who is expected to be crowned champion jockey for a third time at Ascot next Saturday, will return at Newmarket on Saturday but the incident is a dent to his reputation. It also raises questions over Murphy's professionalism, given he served a three-month suspension over the winter after testing positive for cocaine while riding in France last year. That positive was blamed on cross-contamination which Murphy said had occurred after having sex with a woman he later learned was a cocaine user. Murphy, 26, first failed a breathalyzer test when riding at Salisbury in June 2019. Under BHA rules, any second offense within 24 months could incur a ban of up to 21 days. But because Murphy's ban falls outside that time frame, it is treated as another first offense, with standing down for the day the penalty again. However, the BHA Disciplinary Committee can work outside the guidelines should they see fit. Murphy is a role model to many young racing fans, cultivating a big social media following. He used that platform to confirm yesterday's positive test, saying, I'm sorry to all the people I've let down today. I take full responsibility. Murphy's lead in the Jockey Championship was cut to nine, still virtually unassailable, when rival William Buick rode a double on Al Suhail and Siskini, 